Kenny Johnson with Kelly R. Bobby, head coach of McKinney Boyd. Kelly, talk about your splitting the senior class that's been the foundation for the last four years and, and hopefully can take out to another deep run in the playoffs. Yeah, well, let's start with Lexi Lambert. I think um, Lexi is not the, flame, the most flamboyant girl on the court. She's not going to show the most emotion, but what you can count on with Lexi is that she's going to show up and she's going to be ready to play every time. Um, she's probably the most steady um, on the court because I think you have an emotional spectrum and you don't get too high, you don't get too low. She plays with such... Um, consistency that I can always count on Lexi and she's done a great job for us. She can play on the right side and she can play on the left side. She's got a great block um, and she's just steady. So I've, I've appreciated Lexi and, and um, we'll go to Paige next. And he, Paige is a firecracker. We, we've said that the entire time. She brings that energy to the court that's that's the excitement. She, she'll be the girl that gets the huge block that, you know, wins championships. She's going to be that girl that can can go in and fire everyone up. She's got that drive and that um, that personality that kind of brightens up the court. Um, she's been she's been fun to coach. She's been one of my kiddos I got to keep real close to me because she can she can with her personality she can kind of go off. But um, I have enjoyed Paige a lot and then. Um, last but not least is um, Jordan Kylie. She's been my my one of my starters. She's been a staple for McKinney Boyd volleyball for four years. She started when she was a freshman, and um, she's just been a leader. She I've watched her develop over the last four years from a mature freshman to an outstanding senior senior leader. Not only um, on the court, because she's she's that girl. She's our go-to um, hitter. Uh, she leads in attacks and kills this year, but she's also just that leader on and off the court. I can rely on on Jordan to really um, be that coach within the players. Um, I think the girls respect her, and and she just adds a lot. And um, and everyone's right. I'm going to miss this group of of seniors. They have they're very different personalities, but they have created such a great chemistry that. Um, I'm going to miss desperately and, and they all have chosen to go and play at the next level which really makes my heart happy. So I wish them the very best and um, I know they're going to do great things. And my last question, uh, how much of will y'all be leading on them with this being which y'all been building for all year and it seemed like what I noticed is like they slow, it's kind of like a flower. Y'all kind of blossom yeah. with them carrying these sophomores and these juniors. I necessarily carry them but lead them and nobody's been resentful. It's like y'all kind of got stronger through y'all up and down seasons because y'all had some highs and some lows but sure. at the end of the day you were where you want to be here in the tournament yeah every single I mean um, success breeds success and good leaders breed good leaders and so what I can rely on is you know the the leadership from this senior class will continue to trickle down so next year we've got Asia Hardy and Keeley Andrews and um, you know, we have a lot more juniors but that the those leaders can learn from the good and the bad from this senior class but I know that there are there's far more good from this class than than then you can take away it as a negative. So, uh, yeah, so the leadership will continue to grow uh, future leaders. So, I'm, I'm, I mean, what else can you ask for as a coach?